And while we do that, VDOT has been preparing for this storm for a while. Adriana de Alba spoke with them earlier today, and she's in Norfolk with more on what they're doing to keep the roads clear. Adriana. Yeah, well, today the entire day has been dedicated to getting these roads prepared. And at this point, all major roads and interstates within Hampton Roads have been pre-treated. That includes roads in Franklin and I-64 in York and James City County. VDOT staff operating 24 hours right now in Franklin, which is expected to be the hardest hit area in Hampton Roads. Now, although this area isn't expected to be hit the hardest, the Hampton Roads District of VDOT is ready to share its resources with other areas that might be in need. Right now it has three teams ready to deploy to help in other districts across the state if necessary. And district wide VDOT has more than 400 pieces of equipment including snow plows and other trucks, about 25,000 tons of salt, 15,000 tons of sand and 168,000 gallons of salt brine. Even with all of these available resources, VDOT is urging motorists out there to be extra cautious tomorrow. You know, we're ready, we're watching, and we're prepared. And um, we uh, are urging motorists to, if and when this hits, to stay off the roads if they don't need to be out there, to give, especially plows and trucks, uh, extra space. He also said VDOT's biggest concern right now is the potential of temperatures dipping overnight, causing roads to freeze up. But its goal is to have all roads passable within 48 hours of the storm. Adriana de Alva, 13 News Now.